Help me out, my long lost friend. Tell me all that could have been. And if I start to lose myself. Hello! We have a whole day in the sunshine. Uh, instead of a really strenuous cycle, we are cycling slowly. We've got some food and we're going to kick up kick up a nice recipe. What are we cooking? We are cooking a chickpea curry. Chickpea curry. So we're going to take you through. It's one of our favourite um, favorite dishes after a long cycle because it ticks all the boxes. Real tasty, quick to make, cheap, easy to find, but really nutritious too. So yeah, we're going to find a nice spot. We're going to go for a swim along the river. Once we get out of the way a little bit, find a little camp out spot get a little fire going get swimming trunks on make the most of the sunshine leaving the city and we're heading towards greener pastures along the river and there's lots of rowing races going on so there's lots of shouting and fast moving boats and then you also get the odd cyclist cycling along with the boats kind of screaming encouraging them at them Pretty intense. <laughs> <Pretty intense. laughs> so Bob, we have about four weeks until we go. How is the bike getting along? Yeah, it's almost there. So I think like setup wise, I feel quite confident. Um, with like bags and things. The only thing that's yet to do is changing the gear ring. So just getting to know, I'm putting an extra small chain ring on the front um, and need to know exactly what I need to change there. So I've got the shifter, I've got the rear derailleur, I've got the small chain ring, but it's the big chain ring that I need to look into getting. And then my lovely boyfriend is gonna fit it all for, all, for me and I will be there. So, when Sarah says only, she does mean changing it from a single to a double. Yeah. Not so only. <laughs> we have reached our nemesis. Help me out, my long lost friend. Tell me all I could have been. If I stand to lose myself, a secret I can never tell. Oh, oh, meet me down. Now we're looking for a spot to swim. Found a good spot for lunch? Ready to swim. I'll be waiting there for you until the ocean tides rise. Swallow the sky. I'll be waiting there for you. First swim in way too long. First swim of the summer. I don't even. Yeah. Not first swim of the year. We have had a few cold dips, but like, yeah. but like little dips, like waterfall. Yeah. That is the first like swim. Swim. <laughs> swim. And now we're hungry. Yeah. Food. Talk us through the food. Um. Okay. So here we have all of the ingredients. So we're going to start off with a base of um, onion and garlic, which is the basis for most good meals in my opinion. And then we've got coconut milk as the liquid to sort of cook everything in. Chickpeas, good for protein. And then we've got some kale that we're using up and some mushrooms. 
This is our little herb mix. We made it before we came. So, this so what's in the herb mix? Turmeric, cumin, coriander, garam masala, and you could either put the chili powder in here or use fresh chilies, depending on sort of if you're trying to save on space. And then we have a stock cube, and we're going to serve ours with a packet of rice as well. This stuff's great because you can just eat it like this, or you can sort of put it into sauces as well. And it's not how long does it take to cook? It depends on what you're using to burn with. Um, I'm gonna say it's gonna take about 10 minutes. 10 minutes? Yeah. Okay, any marks, get set, go. Okay, I'm starting by chopping the onion. And the finer you chop the onion, the quicker it will cook. But obviously chopping the onion quite finely takes a bit of time. Especially <laughs> with a little knife like that. Stove on, onions in. I'm just using olive oil, but any sort of oil will do. And then the onions are on first because they'll take a little bit longer to cook. In the meantime, I will be chopping my garlic. So I'm going to try and crush it and chop this as finely as I can. I'm going to use five cloves because these are quite small but sort of four big ones will do. So we've got six weeks until we go, roughly six weeks. Uh, we're going through the last bit of um, final bits of white preparation. Um, then the other day we kind of went through like the last tasks that we need to do of Sarah needs to get a new passport, which we're going to get sent to us because there's a massive delay. Um, My passport does have time left on it, it has about a year. But some countries you need, top tip, some countries you need six months left on your passport to enter the country. So, getting a new one of those. Um, we need to get insurance to protect our lovely Trudy and Trevor. Our babies. And um, another really long list which um, was a headache thinking of. And now I can't remember. And one of the most important things that's going on that list is a bigger knife, because this is the whole thing to use. Okay, garlic going in. Getting a real sizzle on. If you want to make this meal a bit lighter and a bit more compact, you can substitute the fresh onion and garlic for onion and garlic powder, and then put it in your pre-made mix. So it just saves you a lot of time, also if you're being tight on fuel, and a bit of effort as well, so you can just use the powder substitutes. It won't taste as good, but it'll taste pretty good. And in the meantime, raw mushroom, coconut milk, pretty good. I don't know if it's um, that mushroom and coconut milk tastes good. It's just that like, coconut milk. <laughs> it just tastes so good. Like any amount of sweetness, it's just almost like an ice cream. Yeah, really yeah. Nice. <laughs> we need that. So I'm putting the whole of our herb mixture in. So we pre made this. For longer trips, you can bring it with you. Um, you can also, if you wanted to have this meal like twice on a trip, you can make double the herb mixture, which we sometimes do. So all of that good stuff is going in. So that's the turmeric, that's the ginger powder, cumin, coriander, and garam masala. Kale in. I'm also going to put the chickpeas in now because it's really nice and they can soak up some of that juice. So you want about two tablespoons of this. I'm going to put the lid on to let everything get really juicy. I'm going to add the mushrooms because there's not mushroom in here. I'll just... I saw that coming a million miles oh, off. I'm so predictable. I love a pun. <laughs> Have you got any other mushroom based puns? Uh, not really because I'm not a very fun guy. Oh, that was great. <laughs> Over and out. Everything's almost at cooking point. 
So I'm going to put some of the fresh coriander in now and then just reserve a little bit of the leaves for the top of it. The finished product. Happy, happy camper. Minus a ton. Oh, oh my god, that's my way. <laughs> right, here's the. Taste test. Look around it. That's really, really good. Hello. Hey. Thank you for watching. Uh, we recorded an outro, but it got really, really windy. And we also and got attacked by a dog that was sort of after the leftover bits of our food. It was a friendly dog, but yeah, it got a bit hectic. A little bit eventful. So we're back in the garden. Uh, but yeah, thank you so much for, for watching. We hope you enjoyed the video. And uh, we're really new to YouTube. Mm -hmm. So um, all the like the likes and comments and subscribes is... Um, yeah, we really like hearing from you guys in the comments. So please keep them coming and let us know what you think of the recipe. If you give it a go, if there are any recipes you'd like to see and what are your favourite sort of camping recipes. We'd really love to find out. So these are the last few weeks until we hit the road for good on mm. our and head off right and east. So we're sort of whistling down all our gear, sort of the bike set up, everything we need to bring, like the route. Yeah, yeah the, it's all to, quite exciting. That cook up has made us reconsider our cooking system. Mm -hmm. um, but yes, if you're enjoying the videos and you want to come along for the ride on our um, round the world, but heading east first. Um, yeah, think about subscribing if you're liking these videos. Definitely subscribe. And we'll take you along for the ride, show you everything we're taking, all the things we're cooking. Mm -hmm. um, all the adventures we're having, all the places we're seeing, and the people that we're meeting, all of it. Yeah, cool guys. Happy rides. Over and out. Bye.